everybody welcome back it is time to plan for the week of christmas eve and i cannot even believe that it's here actually i didn't even realize it was here until i started doing my pre-planning and saw that friday is the 23rd which makes saturday the 24th which means it's almost christmas and i'm not ready anybody else not ready it's fine i'm gonna be fine everybody's fine all right so we are using letters to santa this week you guys have been around you know me i could not resist the orange in this so i grabbed the first sheet of the mini kit the tpc full boxes deco deco journaling and the extra functional sheet so lots to put down this week so let's go ahead and get started date covers this week it's fine we're gonna be fine yeah so leave me a comment below let me know if you're ready for Christmas because we do not have much time but I was super excited when I was uh, pre-planning I did see that I have a wrap gifts and happy holidays and Merry Christmas sticker so perfect timing I actually so I didn't plan the week in between or right after um Thanksgiving because of the Black Friday sale and I like lost a week in there somewhere. I mean obviously I did because I didn't plan it but I was thinking that I was going to end up using next week's kit for the week of Christmas and it's not really falling out that way. So I mean it's still a perfectly beautiful kit. I'm going to be using Holly next week unless I change my mind you know which is bound to happen at some point but um Anyway, yeah, I, uh, I was really thinking that was going to be my Christmas week kit, and it just is not, obviously, because this is my Christmas week kit, which works out just fine. I don't know why I'm even... I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. It's fine. I just don't know what happened at the time. My daughter's birthday is also New Year's Day, so she gets, like, totally gypped for the holidays because she has, um, you know, two gift receiving sessions right next to each other so that's kind of i still have some more shopping to do for that but that will be fine so let's see i just finished the house maid and it was amazing and then perfect timing i just got noticed that the measures which is a book i have had on my hold list for a long while is available and i cannot remember the author right now or even what it's about, but I think it's a thriller. So yeah, that is what is happening in the reading world. I have not been reading very much. Like I did read 82 pages on Monday. I stayed up a little too late reading, but like this has been pretty typical. 23 and 18, 17, 10, 72. I didn't even fill out the end of last week. I'm winning, but anyway, I um, definitely have not been reading as much, but still look forward to it every night. It's just been so busy with being here from 6 a.m. until 6 p.m. type of deal. So yeah, it's fine. Everything's fine. Um, okay, so let's actually move this down. I need to try to figure out, I think I will go ahead and wrap gifts on Wednesday. Day. I think it's Wednesday that I have, or is it Thursday? It's Thursday that I have a late eyelash appointment. So what I do, my husband is so helpful, but he um, does not wrap gifts. So that is 100% on me. But since I have a 545 appointment for eyelashes, I'll just wrap them here at the shop. I usually 
put a workbench in front of a computer, turn on some Netflix, maybe have a beverage, but um, yeah, we will get that done Wednesday because all of the festivities will be happening this weekend. So I just, I'm still in shock. I don't know what happened to the month. I'm also relieved. I, yeah, you know, I say it all the time, but I'm not a huge holiday person. So they like cause me a lot of stress and anxiety, just all the prepping. So it will be good to get those done. Okay, so last week I put the social media stuff in admin time and I thought maybe I should be putting the filming in admin time and still leaving my social media stuff in social media. So that is what we're doing there. And where did my, here it is, okay. I need to put the eyelash appointment. You know, per usual, I'm working on Thursday. Still haven't done Monday through Wednesday yet, but that is okay. We are, it's just how my brain works and we're gonna get through it. So let's grab my eyelash appointment stickers. There we go. So this one is actually, I usually do a three week appointment, but that would have put me at the week in between Christmas and New Year's. And the salon I go to is going to close that week, which is super awesome. Good for them. So yeah, that is going to work for that, which reminds me I need to put Jason's schedule in here. So because of that appointment on Thursday, he will not be coming to the shop or if he does, I will not be here. Have at it, Reller. All right. So there's when or Friday, we'll go ahead and stick him in on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. So we are getting somewhere. Um, we got the two new workbenches delivered yesterday, and those are assembled and ready for Luann to start using, which is exciting. And then just a couple of hours ago, the last or not the last, we ordered 13 shelving units. So the shelving units we order, I cannot remember, they come with four or five shelves, but we um, put more shelves on because we don't need that like much space in between the um, shelving units. So we put more shelves on it than come with it. So I guess I could put these down too. So yeah, when we order 13, I think that will give us nine and a half shelves. So I thought I would buy them in small amounts to kind of help offset some of that like large money going out that goes out at this time of year anyway, because of all of the um, bills that are due at the time, you know, end of the year and that kind of thing. So that'll work out just fine. And that will allow us to fill those up and then we can order more in a couple weeks. So, all right, eyelashes is in. We need my football stickers, which are somewhere over here. Okay. We're going to my sister's on, oh, is it on? The, it is on the 24th. Why did I put it on the, okay, that's fine. Uh, let's see, what do we want to use for my sister's? Definitely need to do, we'll do a happy holidays. And I want to put some sort of deco with it. Um, yep. We're going to do this one and a package. Um, yeah. So that'll go on Saturday. There's that. And then Sunday, my mother-in-law will be coming over. So that will be exciting. We're just gonna do something super chill, just finger foods type of um, gathering for that day. So let's do the orange one. So we we'll put Janet and John. And they are coming over around 12, which will give Jason and I time with the kids to open gifts and spend immediate family time. And then we don't have to leave the house, which I am like super excited about. So, okay. All right. Um, 
Let's do an Aaron's House sticker here. And then we'll do a label for the football game. Hopefully they're not super big football fans, but hopefully they will turn it on for Jason and I will just kind of keep an eye on it. And I'm okay if I, I just kind of want to know what's going on. So that is at 1 p.m. Bengals. Okay, so that takes care of that sticky note. While I am flipped over to this side, we'll go ahead and put my scale on here, which is going pretty well. I've pretty much maintained over the last several weeks, so I'm feeling pretty good about it. And I'm gonna start lifting again once things at work slow down a tiny bit, so that will hopefully help me gain a little bit of weight there too. Okay, let's get that white out covered up. Do I have any more little deco? Where did my deco sheet go? There we go. Perfect. Okay, and nothing like bringing in the holidays uh, and having a dentist appointment. Yay. So that is at 9 a.m. on Tuesday. So that is just a cleaning, so hopefully it will not be too long. And then Luann's weird schedule starts next week. So I think I'll use uh, the little hearts for her. So Monday and Tuesday, she'll be in a little later than normal. So So she normally takes her one son to school, which gets her to the shop at about eight, but he is on, so her two kids go to two different um, schools. So um, he is on vacation uh, all next week. So she's gonna help her husband get the other son on the bus, which works out good. So she'll just be a little bit later than usual. So that will be Monday and Tuesday. And then Wednesday and Friday, she'll be coming in from 5.30 a.m. to noon because then both of her kids will be off and the younger one need somebody home with him, so. Um, and I don't really know what to expect as far as orders go. Um, we are generally very busy the week in between Christmas and New Year's. Uh, so if she's not able to get everything done before she leaves at noon, I'll take over and finish up the shipping stuff, but I feel like next week will be a little bit quieter. 5.30 to noon. Okay. Got to be consistent. I put the whole noon thing there. Okay, I think that takes care of appointments and that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my social media down and my design work stuff down and then we will be back to wrap it up.
have not put down my book stickers yet. So I did get those moved over to my new book. Um, oh yeah, for, for sure using a muted orange color. Which ones do we want to use? Let's do these. I like these, okay. So yeah, definitely need to put that in. I enjoy tracking my reading. Don't look at my week this week, cause uh, or my week from last week, but it is not in there. It's fine, I'll go back and fill it in. There's nothing wrong with a little back planning, right? So put that there, not there. I doubt much reading will be happening on Saturday or Sunday, but still putting it in and I still will read something because I'm on like a streak. This is actually an amazing app. If you guys are looking for a book app, so it's called Bookly and it tells you like how many pages you've read a day. Um, I am on a 117 day long reading streak. So I've read every day for the last 117 days. Today will be day 118. So that is not going to stop anytime soon, but okay. So we got those in. We have plenty of room for full boxes. So let's go ahead and slap some of those bad boys down. We will put this one here and then, hmm. I like the plaid. Do I want to use more of the plaid? Hello, it's me. Of course I do. So we'll put that one in there. And let's see. Friday. What's going to be going on Friday? Trying to clear out orders so that there are not any hanging out open over the holiday weekend. So we'll go ahead and stick that in there. And then if I slide the book over. I'm going to put this one, and I think we can even fit one more in there. I do need to do laundry, but I have a feeling that will just be done over the course of the week as I have time so that I don't have to do it on the weekend. So, all right, any deco that I have to make room for? Where is my deco? Of course there is. We need more gifts. Can I put it over here? I mean, it's my planner. I can do whatever I want, but do I actually have room? I think that one will be okay because we'll be trying to finish up the um, mystery kit processing. So I don't know how far I'll be getting on my kits that day. I want to get those out next week. That is the goal. Okay. Not a huge Christmas cookie person, so we'll leave that one out. But guys, I think this is it. I think this pretty much takes care of doing what we need to do to prep for Christmas. I Have I mentioned I still just cannot believe Christmas is next week. That's fine. We're all going to be fine, right? Well... If I don't talk to you before then, I hope you have a very, very Merry Christmas. If you don't celebrate, I hope you have two days full of your own type of peace and joy. And until next time, take care. Mm -hmm.